In this video, we will create a user account in the administrator tool and assign business glossary privileges and permissions to the user in the analyst tool. Use the analyst tool URL to log into the analyst tool interface. We will log in as the administrator who manages users and roles. Click Glossary Security under Manage to open the Glossary Security workspace. Here, we see a list of users who have access to Business Glossary. We will create a new user account called Finance underscore Steward. To create a new user account, we log into the Administrator tool. Click Security to open the Security tab. We can see the list of users who have accounts in the Administrator tool. Next, we click Create User from the Actions menu. We specify the mandatory properties for the user account. We assign privileges to the user in the Privileges tab. We click the Analyst Service and in the Roles tab, we assign the Analyst Service Business Glossary Consumer Role. In the Privileges tab, we assign the privilege to access the Glossary workspace under Workspace Access. In the Model Repository Service, we assign the privilege to access Analyst under Model Repository Service Administration. This completes the tasks in the Administrator tool. We will log into the Analyst tool as the Business Glossary Administrator. Click Manage to open the Glossary Security workspace. We can see that the user account that we created in the Administrator tool is present. We will assign the Data Steward role and assign permissions for this user to access assets in the Financial Markets Glossary. In the Privileges tab, we select the username and click Add from the Actions menu. We select the Financial Markets Glossary and click Next. We expand the Financial Markets Glossary and assign the Data Steward role from the list of available roles. The Analyst tool assigns the privileges corresponding to the Data Steward role automatically. We can modify the privileges by adding other privileges to the default ones. We click Save to complete the task of assigning a role. The user is now a Data Steward for the Financial Markets Glossary. In the Permissions tab, we select the username and click Add from the Actions menu. We select the Financial Markets Glossary and click Next. We ensure that the user has read and write permissions. To change a permission, we select the permission type and choose from the drop down. We click Save to complete the task of assigning permissions. The user now has access to read and write assets in the Financial Markets Glossary. We can optionally create a custom role and assign the role to users. In the Privileges tab, click Manage Roles from the Actions menu. We can see a list of roles and their default privileges. Click the Add icon to create a role. Specify the name of the role and description and assign default privileges for the role. We can see the new role that we created when we add privileges. That completes this demo. To summarize, we created a user account called finance underscore steward in the administrator tool. We assigned the user the privileges of a data steward by assigning the data steward role in the analyst tool. We assigned permissions to read and write assets to the financial markets glossary for this user. We also created a custom role and assigned default privileges to the role. If you have feedback on this demo or to request a demo on another topic, email us at infa underscore documentation at informatica.com. 
You can also tweet us on the InfoSupport Twitter site.